You guys ready for this? Ready to see our next EMY white truck? You guys Let's gotta go. see this thing, man. This thing is freaking sick. What do you guys think? This thing is absolutely beautiful, you guys. Welcome to Inner Force. Our latest giveaway we call ENR number 29. 29, why is, 20, why is it 29? Guys, because we've done already 28 giveaways. We've done a little more than that, but big giveaways, 28. This is number 29, another badass truck from Inner Force that you have a chance to win along with freaking 50 G's. 50 grand plus a new truck. That's, a, that's the biggest cash prize we do here, you guys. 50 grand, that's enough to cover your taxes, enough for you to have left over to play with. And uh, that is going to one very lucky person. Yeah, you guys, so we're gonna take you on a full walk around of what this truck has and some details about the giveaway and let you get entered to win this badass truck plus 50 grand. As we always say, you guys, home of the shortest giveaways. We're giving you guys just one week one week to get yourself in here to win this beautiful truck and the cash. So if you're watching this video, between which dates is it? Um, March 17th through March. March 24th. That's the only entry period, you guys. So if you're if you're watching this video between those days, now's your chance to get yourself entered and take home a pretty freaking sick truck. It's not a pretty freaking sick, <laughs> it is a sick truck. I mean, look at this thing, dude. Yeah, it's really cool, man. I'm excited to take you guys on all the, the whole walk around of this thing. Um, what we'll do is uh, basically cover all the details, all the fine details that went into this truck that you don't really see until you get up close and personal to it. And mm -hmm. uh, it might just make you fall in love with it just a little more than <laughs> what the initial uh, reaction is when you see this thing. All right, let's jump into this. So we've covered the dates, we've covered what the prize is. There's two ways that you can enter. You can shop with us by picking out your favorite merch from our website, which is interforce.com. Um, anything you buy on our website will get you automatically entered. And the second way is become a VIP member. What's VIP member? VIP member, you guys, we got the, uh, an entry way to get entered by basically paying $20 a month. There's a three different tiers, but $20 a month gets you entered into every single giveaway that we run. And you know, being that this is a one week long giveaway, we usually have two, three, sometimes four giveaways in a month and that automatically gets you entered, in, entered into each one without having to do anything else. So it is the most cost effective way to win and it's something new that we rolled out. So I bet we're gonna have a lot more winners yeah. coming from our memberships. We already have, I think, three winners from VIP memberships. Which is crazy. We just started doing those just a few months ago. So $20 a month, just winning people cars. Yep. Or just go buy a t-shirt, <laughs> go buy a hat. You get something pretty cool, something very comfortable that we love to wear. Everyone loves our products. So go pick that up. That actually does get you entered to win that truck and the money. So. All right, let's dig into this. You guys, you're looking at a 2022 F-250 Super Duty diesel truck right here. And why did we go with the 2022 this time? Uh, well, we like the body style of these trucks. The newer trucks, body styles, they're a little bit, they haven't grown on us I yet. I know, I know. We, we'll do, guys, we'll do a brand new truck, F-350, uh, very soon, but the new body style, that's a little bit uh, on the gray area. We're coming up with visions for the new body styles. It's in process. Seriously, but this this is probably one of my most favorite body styles. And why we went with the 2022 is because of that interior. You get that big screen, which we'll cover in a little bit. Um, but 2022 is my favorite year, and this truck is perfect for it. Um, it's a 2022 F-250. And let me actually just cover something because a lot of people I've heard, they're like, why is it an F-250? Why is it not an F-350? <laughs> we were just talking about it because a lot of people have a lot of uh, different perspectives on what an F-250, what the difference is between an F-250 and a 350. So do you want to just cover that real quick? <laughs> yeah, well, F-350 sounds bigger. I know. But actually isn't bigger. It's the same, same truck and all they do is add an extra leaf spring towards the back of the truck so you can have a bigger payload. That's all it is. Yep. Everything else on the truck is the and same. And the reason we do F-250s is because they are a little bit of a softer ride. 
uh, uh, because they don't have that extra leaf spring in the back. But it just, you know, if you want to turn an F2, F350, add a little leaf spring, that's not a big deal. That's why we give away F250s most of the time. But I just heard somebody was like, bro, it's not an F350 though. I'm like, I don't know if that's, the, that's a deal like, breaker. Really? Come on, it's just a leaf spring. Throw in leaf spring on and you have an extra thousand pounds on your pay, payload and that's yep. about it. Yep. So Look, we took this truck. All uh, right, go ahead. You were going to say something. Look at this color. Yeah, this color is sick. It's a uh, satin metallic blue wrap. So this is a wrap color. It's not factory color. This is wrap. Under the truck underneath is black. So whenever you remove the wrap or you're tired of this blue, sexy blue color, you'll have a black truck. Underneath. I mean, the amount of view, the <laughs> amount of attention this truck gets in the sun, the way the light hits it, it's got a couple different hues to it, which will make it very unique. It's got a, that blue hue to it, but it's got a little bit of that purplish hue to it as well. So in the sun, it dances a little bit. The, <laughs> yeah, the color that's... of this, the exact color of this is Trenton Blue by uh, KPMF. So a really good high quality wrap. And it's also been ceramic coated as well. So uh, when you have these matte wraps, you want to ceramic coat them and protect them from all the elements outside. Uh, but this is probably the big, um, the big thing when it comes to this build, the whole color scheme. Yeah. Looks this freaking bl sick. Satin blue with the black. It just came out gorgeous. So a lot of the details here that we did do uh, when it comes to wrapping, like for example, the, the valence, this is actually a, uh, a two wheel drive valence. So we switched that over from a original ones because the original one has a very big drop. It probably goes down to like here. I think it's like a six inch drop or something. So oh, looks, really? Yeah. Huh. So it's kind of ugly. <laughs> so we uh, went and converted that just to a two wheel drive valence. It made it a little bit shorter, but in order to wrap this valence, you have to paint it because uh, wrap does not stick very good to plastic. So you have to paint it, which was painted black just to match the rest of the truck right there. And uh, after it's painted, you're, then you're able to wrap it. So that is something that we do with a few different pieces uh, when it comes to builds. Um, throughout this truck, there's a few plastic pieces that were just like that, painted and then wrapped. So, cool so, little details, huh? Yeah, I didn't even know that. That's yeah, pretty cool. Yeah. This truck is four wheel drive though. It's not two wheel <laughs> drive. It's a top of the line platinum truck that's loaded with all the bells and whistles. Freaking diesel truck, you guys. Yep. I mean, this is, a, this is a definitely a good, show truck but it's also get shit done type of yeah. truck you know dude this thing has a lot of power too after driving this thing it, i think it pulls better than my uh my yeah, chevy yeah, you're <laughs> saying that now <laughs> you're making my ford heart feel good <laughs> i might have to get a ford myself you know it's pretty, yeah they're pretty quick they're pretty so quick. what size lift is sitting on this thing so we've got a six inch fts kit right here so it's got a six inch lift and that's the, per I love this size of a lift just because of the fact that it's not too much. It's still very practical, but then it's not like every other truck on the road. It's just got a little bit of a stance to it. And uh, yeah, beautiful black, blacked out uh, lift on it. Then we got what, Fox 2.0 with resis all the way around to give you the nice comfortable ride. Mm -hmm. The wheels are 22 by 10 American Force wheels and they're wrapped with 37 inch Toyo tires, some meaty tires. So you got plenty of tire tread on there or not tire tread, tire. Uh, tire. Tire. Yeah, plenty of tire on there. Yeah. yeah. And those are forged wheels. So uh, they're definitely a really nice looking cut right there. And they have been uh, powder coated all the way black. Um, originally they come with a little bit of chrome in them but because of the build that we had a vision for was to mostly keep it black and blue uh we pretty much deleted most of the chrome we kept the only chrome i think we kept was the shocks the fox shocks on there all so, right moving back up here you guys uh so we took these headlights um ripped them or I shouldn't say it right. That sounds, <laughs> that sounds very uh, <laughs> <laughs> So they were precisely cut open. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds a little better. Well, that's how it is, but uh, so you open up these lights and uh, we just murdered them out. Uh, basically all the chrome was deleted and we tinted uh, the side marker here and gave it a little bit of a smoke look inside the headlight. Yeah, two-tone grill. All the blue is the wrap underneath it's black, so. Got a nice little touch over here with the Ford coming through. Mm -hmm. And it's like a show truck uh, kit, yeah. show truck over here. It looks super good and it I looks don't know. good. It looks really good. <laughs> the color is just perfect. 
So we went ahead and played with the same scheme of the lights as well. So the headlights, as you see, the, the original DRLs are white. So we continued that white look with the uh, Recon sequential uh, mirror lights right here, the side mirror lights. These are sequential, so they have a little bit of a, or when you turn your turn signal on, they do turn orange and they have a little flow to them. And then also the uh, Recon uh, tow, tow markers, tow lights. So right there, these, uh, did you see the, uh, the sequential pattern they do? No. Yeah, I'll turn them on real quick. So those are pretty cool. <laughs> oh, okay, they like flash. They got a little flash to them. All right, all right, a little, little character. character. <laughs> so that probably turns on when you remote start the truck too. Yeah, when you stuff. start the car, that's when that sequential nice. pattern kind of plays a little bit, so. And then the mirror lights, uh, since we were just talking about them, these were also, the plastic was smoothed, painted black, and glossed out just to match the rest of the glossiness look, the glossy trim of the rest of the truck. Very cool. Mm -hmm. We got tint. Like always, like 5%, always. 30% on the windshield. So people can't see who's driving, you know, who won the truck. Yeah, they'll only see you whenever you want them to see you by rolling down <laughs> that window. <laughs> and so the, we've also got the uh, side, side uh, vents and those were painted. Um, and we had the wrap even very precisely cut in order to ride it out platinum, baby. Platinum truck right there. What does that mean? That's the one of the highest trims. Yeah, it's there's big, a limited, limited, right, limited above that. Yeah, but it's like the same thing. It's just the only mm -hmm. difference with limited, I think, is just the color scheme. Mm -hmm. And sure. different interior. I think the limited the interior, comes with yeah. a little light gray color. Yep. Let's see, what else? As we keep walking towards this side of the truck. We've got, of course, our steps, our retractable steps that uh, serve a good purpose for our boys and girls, yeah, our ladies. Help. Yeah. And our men, <laughs> which is perfect. Every time you open a door, you guys, uh, that step pops out, allows you to basically just climb right up in there and uh, gives you that a little bit of clearance that you need instead of hopping in there. Um, yeah, those I can't are, imagine life without them. Yeah, dude, it sucks not having them. Whenever you get them, it's like a yeah, night and day difference. You close the door and away they go, like they're never here. Yeah, just a beautiful color, dude. Yeah. I like this color. It's subtle, it's not too much. Yeah, the one thing we've always, we've been having issues with was really catching this color on camera. Like just getting that true in real life perspective of what it is, just because there's so many hues to it, but we'll do our best, you guys, so you can see exactly how beautiful this thing is. Yeah, hopefully the camera's picking it up. Uh, rock lights, we got what, 24 rock lights underneath the truck, so it lights up this truck really yeah. well. Let me turn them on. Um, should have turned them on to begin with. You know, we only done this 28 times. <laughs> You'd think we'd uh, get this thing figured out. Is it on? No, it's not on. I think the ignition needs to be popped on. Oh yeah. All right, now it's on. There you go. So those uh, rock lights also, by the way, you guys, is wired to a auxiliary switch inside your cabin. So the Fords have an auxiliary panel right above you, which uh, makes it very nice clean. Uh, type of accessible thing. So mm -hmm. you basically just pop the switch open and then boom, you got your rock lights on. Coming rear, back here. The rear looks just as good as the front. It does look good. I like it. Tinted tail lights, plaque is blacked out with the satin blue platinum em emblems in there. Gives it that nice, subtle, classy, clean mm -hmm. look. Looks good. It does then look good. We've got our uh, uh, adjustable tow hitch right here. That's from, um, what are they called? Uh, Gen Y? Gen Y, yeah. Gen Y hitches. We've been putting them on most of our trucks actually. So Gen Y hitch right there. And what makes them really nice is depending on the, your height of whatever you're towing, uh, you just pop this pin out, move this uh, slot up, slot down, whatever you need it. And it just makes a very easy way to level out your load. So we've got our trunk here trunk. A little soft open there for you. Got a step. Little Man, they make it super easy these days. I know, right? Oh shit bar. <laughs> <laughs> Fifth wheel prep, so whatever you need. There's even lights over here. You hit this button, your trunk lights up. Turn it on, turn it off, so pretty cool. Yeah. Patrick forgot to clean the trunk. <laughs> so it's already bent line. Ready to be put to work, you guys. Put this thing away. 
you got it. Oh, is it like on the side right there? I don't know. Oh, there's a button here. No. This is awkward. <laughs> we got it, you guys. We got it. Oh, okay, so it goes down. I uh, see it says step one. <laughs> Does it say it's step one usually? Yeah, the yep. number one. So one, two. Can't be skipping. <laughs> Glad we figured it out. I think this is the first one we ever opened up in our walk around. So that's why this thing just goes right back in there. Close that right, right up. Boom. Boom. Perfect. Then just going down here, we've also added a, just for mostly appearances, I mean, it does have benefits, uh, but it, it is a diff cover right there. It's a Banks diff cover. We've added a little bit of that wrap just to match the rest of the color scheme. But yeah, makes the uh, bottom side look a little bit more um, cleaner and looks more badass. Than so I don't know if you knew, but the Banks diff cover is the only functional diff color uh, diff cover out in the market. No shit. All the other ones, the square the ones, they make it even worse because oh, it's shit. supposed to cool and it's supposed to keep the flow of the liquid going smoothly. And all those square ones or flat ones, they actually make a lot of air oh. and it makes it worse for the oil and stuff. So this one actually performs and it cools like the way they designed. And it looks, I think it looks probably one of the better yeah. looking ones out on the market. So really cool touch. And then what all we did was it, this truck is stock, but we did add a little bit of an MBRP. Which is unfortunate. Unfortunate, we have to keep them stock, but we just added a MBRP <laughs> exhaust tip just to you know keep the whole color scheme going. So <laughs> unfortunately, yeah, you guys, we have to keep our truck stock and we do keep them stock. Um, but these 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 Fords when they're two and they are rowdy, they get oh. going, man. They get going. So <laughs> yeah, that's kind of the outside of this truck. This side looks a lot like the other side. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, that third brake light I didn't mention is just has a little bit of tint to it. Basically deleted the red in it, and the roof was also left black. So. Mm -hmm. That is about it for the outside of this beauty. You wanna just go back there? We got better yeah. lighting over there on this side. Yeah, it glows from this side. Mm -hmm. Why is the Viper still here? Well, we just, we haven't got the name back for the Viper. We're supposed to be getting that probably when this giveaway is live. So yeah. when you're watching this, we should be announcing the winner sometime within this week. And uh, that's our 28th giveaway. 28th giveaway, 29th Nine. giveaway. See, if you had a membership, you'd be entered into that one and this one automatically. <laughs> Dude, it'd be crazy if somebody with a membership was gonna win that thing. That's crazy. And then they're gonna That's watch crazy. this video and like, oh, that was me. <laughs> <laughs> What um, do we got, interior? Interior, man. Oh, dude, interior is gorgeous on this thing. You gotta it come sure around is, this yeah. side. So this interior, which is when we first got this truck and we were like playing with the colors, we were like, we're not sure if the red or the burgundy, I should say, is gonna be a good, uh, good color, complementary color to one another with a blue. But actually, it looks sick. It does. It really is very complementary, just probably because those are two opposite colors on the spectrum. But the blue, with this burgundy just freaking pops, man. It looks really good. And it's a unique color. You just don't see that many F-350s or F-250s with that color. So, very, very beautiful. Starlight headliner in there. <clears throat> yeah, that's an 1,000 piece Starlight headliners, ladies and gentlemen. Our special touch from Inner Force. <laughs> <laughs> yep, yep. That, that, that is beautiful. I love that touch, man. That thing switches colors and it's got all the bells and whistles. I mean, any color you want, it'll play, change colors to the sound you're playing or the music you're playing. So it's really cool. Kids love him. I love him. Yep. You love him. I mean, I love him. It, it's a and sick touch, dude. It's also got that full panoramic roof that the Fords are known for. So you literally got the full roof that is openable so open the bowl yeah you can open it o open the bowl <laughs> <No, I mean. laughs> that and then it actually has a functional sunroof too so the sunroof opens up as well this is the one of the bigger sunroofs yeah uh, does it not open anymore okay there no, we go yeah, it opens up i was gonna way. say that's uh that's pretty nice that's pretty nice we should rock the blue color in here that's, that's the little remote you guys get right there. Boom. Change colors, and it's also on an app on the phone as well, so you can do whatever color you want. First off, this truck is equipped with massaging seats. You hit platinum, a button. Platinum, baby. Platinum. You hit this button, 
and uh, it starts massaging your butt and your butt at the same and your back at the same time. Well, you could actually even decide what what uh, massaging settings you want. You could do a little lower back roll, a little upper back roll, a little full recovery. You know, it's kind of nice after a gym day. You know, you just need a little bit of a relaxation. You know, spa in most your car. people go to work. <laughs> it's after work they should hey, relax. You can, if you can have a spa in your car, take it, man. <laughs> So yeah, uh, heated and cooled seats up front. The rear seats are heated as well. They're not you cooled. You got your little switches back there that you just boom, pop, pop them up. And you actually got a couple settings for the amount of heat you want back here, so. Yeah, so this is the new upgraded version of the Fords. These, uh, this upgraded version and infotainment screen is what is in the, it's not in 2024, right? Uh, or is it? Ah, uh, shoot. It might be, I think it, it goes be. up to 2024. You got your four wheel drives here. You got all your heated, cooled seats, big old screen, CarPlay, uh, um, Android Auto. Um, so yeah. Yeah, everything that you can do is right there on that screen, which is really cool. It's very accessible, very uh, uh, responsive. And it's got those beautiful cameras right there, full 360 camera right there. So you got that Viper right in front of you. And then you can also add a camera here to like, um, if, let's say if you have a trailer, you can throw on a camera for your trailer and have that, your hitch, or is this your rear of the truck, 360. Yeah, so you got uh, plenty of cameras to not hit anything it when you're very driving. Handy. Yeah, very uh, handy. This truck has only 11,000 miles on it, so pretty much brand new. I don't think it's broken in yet. Um, what else? Yeah, it it's, smells good in here, it smells nice. This this truck actually has pretty good sound system. It's got the B and O. What's the B and O stand for? Oh, I don't know. Bang Olsen. About <laughs> what? Banging Olsen. Banging Olsen? Okay, that's a pretty high-end system. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, nice, it's bro. got everything you need on it. Sick truck, sick truck. Yeah, you got very comfortable. charging cables here. Closes up all neatly. If you want four cup holders, you can have four cup holders. If you want two, you got two. This opens up, whole bunch of storage. Yeah. Got a few little storage compartments over here. Pop those open, you know, for your passengers. Take care of them a little bit. Yeah, look at this. It even has a backup trailer for people that don't know how to back up a trailer. So when this is hooked up, you connect your trailer to it with these little sensors and then you turn on a reverse and then you pretty much go, okay, turn it to a little bit left and it'll do the steering by itself. Oh, no shit. Yeah. I never knew that. Yep. <laughs> but I think this is, this just takes more time to do I, than actually just bada yeah. beam, bada boom and back it up. Huh. Okay, they just think of everything for you, huh? They make it easy for people that don't know how to drive. Yeah, so very clean. <laughs> I know, right, you can't really mess this up. You got cameras, you got backup over here. You got all kinds of sensors going off. Uh, you get, you're, go you're coming up too fast on somebody, it'll start beeping at you. Um, so yeah, yeah, adaptive cruise control. Lane I mean, assist. It's, it's loaded, it's loaded. Yep. Technology these days is, th these yeah. days is pretty sweet. Just, if, and if you're just bored, you know, just get under the stars for a minute, you know, let the stars <laughs> twinkle. Pick your favorite color, you know, and just take a nap, man. <laughs> take a nap. <laughs> I need one, man. It's been a long day. <laughs> it's been a long week. <laughs> so yeah, very full, fully loaded, you guys. Platinum truck. So yeah, you guys, this is what's up for grabs for the next seven days, if you're watching this on the first day that it launches. Yeah, seven <laughs> days, ladies and gentlemen, to get entered from start to finish. There is no crazy surprises. All we give you is just one week for you to have a chance to win it. If you like it, get entered because it will be gone just like that. Um, so. If you don't like it, still get entered because when you win, you're getting the title, the keys to it, and there's no strings attached. You can go sell it, you can do whatever you want with it the next day. So Yeah, a lot of our past winners over here that you see on the wall actually either sold, a lot of them sold their trucks, not a lot of them, I'd say probably half of them, sold their trucks, they drove them, enjoyed them, and they're like, all right, I'm ready to get, I'm ready to cash out, baby, get my money out of this thing. And they cashed out, took their checks, sold them a lot of them mm -hmm. actually did also keep them because they just love the trucks yeah which is cool because john who is way back there our very first our winner very first winner uh he, we gave away that f-150 if you guys remember 
he still has his truck. Still loves that thing. Four years ago. That's which is insane. Insane. Man. That's, that's what awesome. you're able to do when it, when it comes to any one of our giveaways. You know, you can keep it, sell it, do whatever you want with it, put it to work. You will get all sorts of attention. And this one's deserving of that, man. This is this turned out beautiful. Yeah, for sure. Very cool build. All right, you guys, get entered. If you like the truck, you want the truck plus 50 grand, tap that link, go get entered before it's too late. Then who knows? You might be coming over here in about two weeks and we'll be handing you those keys, the title, the cash. Here's your chance. Tap that link or get your, just scroll down, find something on the website, get yourself entered. See ya. See ya.